what's up guys so welcome to another video so for this video I will be teaching you how to ceiling shot so you probably saw my montage if you didn't yeah I think if you did you s you've seen the first like clip of the ceiling shot must have like that clip took a long like that, that took a lot that took a lot of time so you're probably here for the the ceiling shot video so yeah I, I learned the ceiling shot when I learned the air dribble because it was very easy so I just want to talk about the easy fundamentals of it so for a ceiling shot to work you need basically the same setup of an air dribble if you don't know the setup, I've already discussed it in my in my how to air dribble video. But I'll just be saying saying it again. So you need to go with the ball and boost a bit, break, and then boost. Like boost hit hit the boost button once or twice, then jump off the wall. And then after you jump off the wall you want to boost up. But a lot of people say that the easy ceiling shot is the one where you drive off the ceiling instead of jumping to it. They say jumping to it is just freestyling. And I recommend for you to jump. But obviously you need to learn the ceiling shot before, after you learn how to air jump. So I'll start with the fundamentals right here. So the only thing really that is required for you to do a ceiling shot is to not air dribble. That that's it. So yeah, you want to take the ball, drive a bit, break, boost, hit this, jump, and boost down, and just go to the ball and flip. You could add a musty flick, uh, a normal flick, just a normal flip. Well, at the beginning, you're going to flip normally. Like I'll try to attempt a ceiling musty. Yeah, I don't know. And all my ceiling musties, I just pop the ball way too up. But as long as you do the air dribble setup, yeah, the air dribble setup um, has a lot of pop. That was the air dribble setup. It has a lot of pop, and it's pretty neat. And you could go also go from a ceiling shot into an air dribble, and you'd still have the flip. So it's, uh, yeah, you could do that, but I really haven't learned that yet. So... Like I said, all you need for this is to not to air dribble. And these things, if you like the air dribble and the ceiling shot, if you want to do them in game, you obviously need a bit of good boost. But if you have less boost, I feel like you should use like the you should use you should use the ceiling shot more instead of the air dribble. Because air dribble would use a lot of boost. So if I don't have a lot of boost, I wouldn't obviously just hold the boost and flip into the ball. Let's show you. Let's do it off the left wall. There. And you, uh, you want to aim into the goal. I'll try to score one. Okay, ignore that. So yeah. Oh. By the way, I didn't warm up, so all you're seeing is me just opening the PS4 and getting ready to make a, a how-to ceiling shot video. It, obviously, if I warmed up, this would have been a lot better, but there, I missed. But if you really want a ceiling shot and use the flip, you need to learn how to like, flick. Because if you don't know how to flick, the flips would be useless because you don't have to you don't know how to use them. You don't need to learn a musty flick or breezy. You don't need to learn a drazer flick either. All you need is just a basic flip. Just know how to flip, where to flip, and what your flip what will your flip do. So yeah. If I really try to score one, I will. Well, I did try once, and I whiffed. But I feel as long as you can get to the ceiling, anything is possible. Or right there, if you didn't have boost, you can do that and aim it. 
So I'll just talk about the fundamentals real quick. So you want to take the ball up to the ceiling. No, you don't want. You want a good pop by the air dribble setup. You want to jump to the ceiling or drive up to the ceiling. You want to boost down a bit so you can catch up down to the ball. And you want to get ready to choose your flip. That that that's a horrible flip, but that had a lot of lift on it. So also in my last air dribble video, I couldn't. I didn't know how to air dribble uh, from the left wall because I didn't know how to use the arrow left. But I did grind the arrow left after it for about five minutes, and I learned how to arrow left. So yeah, I'll show you just one air dribble. So. I want to make sure that I already made a couple of air dribbles off the left wall in my monitor, but it's just basically the same setup. Okay, maybe, maybe I haven't gotten used to it, but maybe because I didn't warm up. Before every video, I warm up, even for the montage, I warmed up. Okay, I'll just make this real quick, and then yeah. I'll attempt the swing shot musty once. There, I can air the ball off the left wall. That was totally air control. The setup was you, like I I noticed what I'm doing wrong. The most important thing in the setup I've already set is the angle. Well I'm doing the angle pretty not like it, it it's not that big of a deal. No, but it is. I'm not I wasn't saying that, I was just like, if you're probably think that. Like a couple centimeter no centimeters the ball isn't that long like a couple of the smallest units ever um, wouldn't count like the smallest units ever could matter if I just move my dialogue stick a bit it won't count they really need to learn something also the reason I wanted to learn the ceiling shot really it's because of insane high level plays of pinches. But I'll be coming, I'll start to learn uh, like how to air dribble for a long time and how to do sprinting air dribbles. And I'll make a tutorial on that because I didn't really find any on YouTube. And then I'll make video on these two. So yeah, let's just, just just make the smallest, um, the smallest like, simplification of a zing shot ever. Use the air dribble setup, jump after hit the ball by a couple of seconds, and then boost down, and then hit the ball up. But for you to go up to the ceiling, because probably if a lot of views get, like if a lot of views are here, probably people would say like, how do I jump off the wall? I'm not getting enough height. You have to get used to that. I'll just say this real quick. I boost a bit and then jump. I get enough height, but you might want you might have enough boost, so you could use a bit more boost to go up, then use a bit more boost to go down. So yeah, guys. There, I just taught you how to ceiling shot. And if you need help with any other thing, just comment it down below, and I will help. I the next uh, video on how to do would be on how to gain air control without using any workshop maps like I did and yeah so if you need any other videos I will be thinking about making them and if this video gets 10 likes I will upload one of the most sickest uploads ever and I will grind till I learn the the Rocket League's mechanics before I reach champ. Okay, maybe not that much, but uh, I, at least most of them. But yeah, so if you guys wanna learn any mechanic, just tell me. I'd probably have enough control for it. I'll just take five minutes off and learn how to do it. So yeah, guys, just like and subscribe if you're new. See ya.